All right, Mark, Japanese striker, Masato Kudo, new uh, white cap. Looks like he's got it to put the ball in the net anyway. Well, let's, yeah, we'll wait and see. We're not going to judge anyone too much from the highlight reel. They it keep talking about that. It is an impressive funny. highlight reel. Uh, yeah, a guy who can score with both feet. A uh, guy who's scored a few with his head. He's got good movement. Um, he can play up top alone. He's played with in partnerships. He's played a bit on right wing, so a versatile player. Not not the country everyone I think expected uh, the striker to come from with with Carl Robinson going to Latin America so often. But um, the guy's done very well in the J League. Almost 100 goals in about 260 games. So certainly his strike rate is impressive. Uh, let's see how he translates to MLS. How he handles the travel and the new league, and new teammates. I think what we've learned last year again from Octavio Rivero, hot start, cool finish. Um, you just got to wait and see with these guys and, and um, uh, how they fit in. One thing that intrigued me was this is a guy who was actually he was starting in Japan. It was not like this is a guy that was surplus to to uh, to his team. No, good player, teammates. one of the top top scorers in the in the J League the last uh, you know two three four years, um, and a, and a good age too. The Caps you know 25 years old. Th these are the types of players they said they were going to go after. Guys who are in their physical prime, um, players still with potential to get better. So we're seeing that, you know, a continuation of this uh, going after unheralded guys, guys, you know, you don't know their names and they're hoping they can make a name in Vancouver. So for those fans who are hoping for and expecting them to splurge this off season and maybe go after a name, it, you know, it's not going to happen, it looks like. Last question. I mean, uh, it's always tough to read Robbo. We, we know what his preference is in terms of lineup, but do you really see him playing two strikers up front? Because to me, I look at the way Kudo plays and he, he strikes me as the kind of guy that maybe is the perfect partner for Octavio well, Rivero. Well, they wanted two things. They wanted someone who could complement Rivero, play in the same lineup as him, and also someone who can push him, play similar position and start over him if he's struggling. Because they didn't have that last year. You know, he, they could turn to Darren Maddox. They obviously didn't want to do that. So um, I think in Kudo, they think they have both. And a guy who can also play on the right. So um, could stay, you know, in that 4-2-3-1 formation and have him in that with Rivero as well. So I think Carl Robinson likes that flexibility.